15 seconds. The, uh, the way the axes work is the x-axis is just a motor and the cup will be sitting on it. Obviously this is prototype to not final form. But this is the x and it just rotates while the um, laser is on a y. However, the final implementation will actually have the y-axis underneath the motor lifting it up and down. So here's how this laser is set up. The uh, TTL control is from the tiny G's M, uh, sorry, spindle output. It goes into a laser driver. I got this laser driver on AliExpress. It can handle three amps, and it has 10 kilohertz worth of TTL. So this um, spindle on/off is just going into the TTL value, and then the ground connection, and your uh, you um, you send in the power, and I just have that on another. Um, that's really just a buck converter. But this thing, I'm sending in about 12 volts to it. I think it could take up to 15. And then this runs to the laser. So this laser is a um, actually a 6-watt blue diode laser. It is just temporarily prototyped onto this linear stage. The key is this driver. This driver actually was only about $9. Um, and it really is nice. And you can control the current from this pot. You can also control voltage, but that's not really that necessary. Um, and it will handle up to 3 amps. And I'm only really running it at about 800 milliamps uh, to, to, to drive the laser.